Hello, my dear young friends. Welcome to yet another session of e-content uh, learning. In today's session, we will discuss about uh, the importance of uh, group uh, discussion (GD). What is the importance of uh, group discussion? Group discussion is a very important uh, feature when it comes to selection of uh, candidates for any job for any job and for any course also and now in this uh, session uh, we will discuss about what uh, it really requires what is required uh, by the group discussion uh, to make it uh, uh, successful in the outcome group discussion requires here a host of uh, skills uh, for successful participation in a discussion so plenty of skills uh, as i told you earlier the interpersonal skills and even uh, intrapersonal skills and uh, social uh, quotient the sq and uh, emotional quotient the eq also is quite uh, important because uh, all these qualities go a very long way to make uh, the impact of group discussion uh, very useful in the long run as a result of which uh, these features are very important and also to participate in a group uh, discussion uh, one must have sufficient knowledge and uh, the depth of knowledge must be uh, really good because uh, knowledge is uh, no doubt power knowledge gives you enormous power and confidence and uh, material to present uh, the facts there's a there's a lot of uh, importance given to knowledge and knowledge definitely helps you in uh, any group discussion the participation uh, with knowledge is significantly more productive and more qualitative than compared to a discussion uh, wherein uh, uh, the knowledge factor is Uh, below the par as a result of which uh, the importance of knowledge is always on the higher side and uh, for the presentation of the topic and to catch the attention of all the participants involved and in sustaining the interest all through and sitting uh, without distracting others and also initiating a discussion a leading a discussion and then concluding all this involve uh, the ability on the part of the candidates with uh, knowledge because it is not very easy to attract the attention of others because there is always enough opportunity and scope for distraction so to overcome such and distractions and to bring the attention of all the listeners itself is a very challenging uh, task and sometimes it requires the ability to give the voice uh, uh, to the voiceless so group discussion is kind of a forum sort of uh, to say wherein the voice uh, why the voiceless also are given the voice uh, and to express their opinions and to express their views and disagreements agreements and uh, trying to learn something new and uh, face criticism and uh, uh, disagreement also with uh, maturity because certain discussions and discussion points are very critical and uh, there could be a few flash points and also some heated arguments during this session which is why 
it is quite important that uh, a kind of uh, maturity in your thinking and uh, the way how you handle stress uh, when you are when you are uh, arguments or when you are point of view is not taken kindly by the others and uh, as you all know the group discussion has the basic structures of uh, a beginning then the middle and also a conclusive part so what is the significance of a uh, group discussion here group discussion it requires the participation of uh, the candidates uh, who in turn help uh, the success of any group discussion and candidates as you know with various differences of opinion also uh, try to express their point of view and also try to accommodate the other person's point of view because candidates or the participants uh, learn to accept and rather they have to learn to accept the other person's point of view because nothing is absolute right sometimes we also learn our mistakes when we listen to uh, the points and opinion of others and now what you need to do what precautions you need what you need to take care uh, during and before you reach a uh, group discussion now reach the location very well in advance there should not be any last minute uh, hurry last minute rush to reach the uh, location to reach the place and you must try to always organize your ideas and present with coherence and with lot of cohesion you must arrange your thoughts in a systematic manner without any kind of a digression because it's very easy to digress to divert to get diverted and go into other kinds of thinking that is quite possible so you must try to avoid thoughts uh, which will lead to digression and very important thing is you must also take care of your dress code preferably you must always be dressed in a formal wear so that uh, uh, your seriousness is really shown and you appear uh you know mentally prepared to be in that place and for a formal occasion so your appearance must be planned and due care must be given for your appearance and uh, during the group discussion uh, it is highly advisable not to be offensive or uh, abuse you also no matter what because it is the demand of discipline in the conduct of uh, a group discussion and moreover one must never abuse uh, the fellow participants or put down fellow uh, participants there instead uh, you could also you know learn something uh, from the other person's uh, point of view Uh, and uh, you must not uh, distract or you must not uh, fiddle with the pen or do something uh, which will cause some kind of uh, a lack of uh, seriousness in uh, group discussion and when it comes to uh, the dressing part once again uh, one must avoid being very gaudy the gaudy appearance uh, the overly done makeup all the lipstick the perfumes uh, these are all examples of over makeup so these are all not advisable what you need to do is you need to dress appropriately uh, for the occasion and uh, you need to adopt the formal language because your language must be very 
polished and sophisticated because there is a lot of difference when we use uh, informal language and uh, colloquial language because uh, you must always uh, respect the seriousness and the formality of the occasion isn't it because the purpose of group discussion is to bring the best in you and uh, as long as you are not serious it is very difficult to bring out the best uh, in you so to conclude uh, as you know group discussion is a methodological tool to select and to bring the best candidates into any particular course or even into employment also and group discussion will help in accommodating uh, the views of everybody without being offensive and the group discussion uh, can be used to evaluate a candidate's skill skills while summarizing uh, you need to be very brief and concise during a group discussion with this i conclude my session on uh, group discussion thank you my dear friends for your patient hearing